Hey everyone, welcome back to Tenorshare. Did your iPad suddenly get stuck on the Apple logo and can't get out? Don't worry, we've got you covered. Whether your iPad is stuck on the Apple logo during an update, restore, or just out of the blue, we're here to help you through the panic. Let's go. Since this is mainly caused by a system issue, try a force restart to get it out of the system crash. Let's try. Quickly press and release the volume up button. Then the volume down button. Press and hold the power button for 10 seconds. Like this. Until you see the Apple logo reappear, then let go of it. It can do a complete clean reboot on your iPhone to resolve various software issues such as crashes or getting stuck, and this will not lose any data. If your iPad is still gets stuck on Apple logo, it might be a system bug causing the issue. In that case, you need a computer to perform the following fix. So here, I will show you how to fix your iPad without data loss using Reiboot. Let's see how it works. After downloaded Reiboot, connect your iPad with an official cable and click the green start button in the system repair area. Choose system repair to fix your device without data loss. It might guide you to put your iPad in recovery mode. It's simple, just like a force restart, but press the power button longer. Press the volume up button, then the volume down button, and then long press the power button until your device enters the support interface. If it goes to the download page, then you're in recovery mode. Download the matching firmware to repair your iPad error free. The download speed depends on your internet speed. When it's done, click System Repair to let it scan and fix the system. Although it's a paid version, it's the most cost-effective way to fix your iPad stuck on the Apple logo. Because when you go to a repair store, that will cost you even more. When the system repair is done, your iPad will return to normal without data loss. Remember to take care of your iPad and free up your storage to keep the system running smoothly this time. If your iPad's OS version is outdated, it may cause the device to get stuck on the Apple logo. So you can also try to update your iPad with your computer. You can use iTunes, Apple device, or Finder. Just find the official app that's suitable for your computer. Then open the app and connect your iPad to it. You also need to enter recovery mode on your iPad this time. Just like a force restart, but press the power button longer. Press the volume up button, then the volume down button, and then long press the power button until your device enters the support interface. Once detected, the app will give you the options to update or restore. Opt for the update if you wish to retain your data. The app will download the latest firmware and initiate the update process. However, if your phone is stuck on the Apple logo due to an upgrade, this method may not work and may easily cause a second error. In this case, you will have to restore your iPad and your phone data will be lost. You can try Reiboot if you don't want to lose your data. If none of these methods work, it might be a hardware issue. In this case, it's best to visit an Apple store or an authorized service provider for further assistance. They can diagnose the problem and suggest repairs or replacements if necessary. That's all for today. If you found this guide helpful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more tech tips, or leave a comment with any question, whether it related or not. We are always here to help. See you next time.